All right, people of YouTube, this is one of technically three packages because one is coming tomorrow for my BMW X3 2007. Got it for 2,500 from one of my clients that I did videos for and been working with. Lately, you guys already seen them before. Uh, a couple of times I popped the videos up inside one of my channel updates. But anyways, this is some accessories, some upgrades I got from my BMW. I'm still working on it mechanically. I've been working on it mechanically and cosmetically at the same time. And I've been surprised how much people have been um, really into me working on my um, BMW, you know, a lot of people have been intrigued by it, you know, and that's been taking me by surprise. And a lot of people have been watching these vlogs. One, two, three, four, five, six things inside this box. I wasn't playing no damn games. And uh, total, the total price I spent on all this stuff is $195 from Amazon.com. Now we gotta wrap that Amazon. I haven't done a live unboxing in a minute, so forgive me. Well, it's not live, but you guys get what I'm saying. I got my key up here, <clears throat> just in case this was one of the packages that came with my um, sticker, which it does, I see it right here. Comes with a little white sticker right here, official BMW. This look real good, it look way better than the one on my other key. Hold on, let me get my other key real fast. So here's my other key. And here's this. I don't know, it just look a little bit more sleek to me. Oh yeah, so I do got two BMW X3s for people that don't know. I got a 2004 as well, which is uh, which got seven codes I need to fix, but I'm not going to. I'm going to go ahead and salvage it out or sell it for around 2000 or 1500 I think these are the in-dash lights that I got to change my lights from that orange to the uh, bright white that you'll see inside modern cars, you know, so... Hopefully, hopefully this fits my in-dash. I didn't really get a chance to watch the video before I got to order these. I did watch a couple of videos, but right, on to the next thing. What's this? Put a little slit inside there. I think these are my headlights. Yeah, these are my headlights. I think they are, no, these ain't the headlights. These are the uh, fog lights, the orange fog, fog lights. So I can't wait, man, that's, this is bad boy looking nasty. I'm gonna have the little, I got the uh, super bright blue, like the slightly blue headlights, you know what I'm saying, coming. And it might be already here. So, pop this bad boy on open. Oh, so this is one of the main things I was looking forward to, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna put one on the passenger side as well, but this is a glasses holder. So, you know that little handle that no one ever uses, you know what I'm saying, to hold on to or hang clothes on? No one ever uses that damn thing, you know? So, that's what this is for. You unscrew that, you screw this in, in its place. And you guys know I'm always wearing my damn, um, I'm always having my sunglasses and then, this is perfect because inside the car, I never be really having no designated place to put it. I always be telling myself I'm buying glasses, a little clip, but this is even better. You know what I'm saying? Pop your glasses up inside there. Boom. Okay. So yeah, this was like 30 damn dollars. I would have ordered two of them, but like I said, I was trying to get a whole lot. So this is like 30 bucks. These headlights and these fog lights was like, I think these are like 20, 25 bucks, something. I'm gonna have all this stuff inside the description if you wanna buy some of this stuff. So, this is Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. I'm still moving what the hell this is. It's looking like a damn bomb right about now. I think these are the pillows. I got them inside this, uh, okay, I see. So yeah, these are the um, the neck pillows. I got a little pillow that I take from out the house that I use inside my car, you know, for my neck all the time, so. Shit. So these are little bone pillows. Got some decent reviews on Amazon. Kind of wrinkled. Hopefully these wrinkles go out. I can just run a little iron across it, you know, but yeah. Pretty cool. And these 
should be my interior lights, which I'll make them blue this time. Super bright blue. I like how that looks as well. So we got LEDs right here. Bada boom, bada bang. So this definitely was not made for a BMW X3. This doesn't even reach all the way from here to here. So it's like. So I don't know what I'm gonna do about that. I don't know if I'm gonna keep this right here or, or what, because you got this little opening right here and that look kinda, you know, I might have to do something, a little something right here. All right, so coincidentally, my BMW X3 carbon fiber hood and trunk logo, logo emblems just came right now today. And the same day that, you know, I'm unboxing these packages. And I've been waiting for this for almost a month already. Hopefully these right here look nice and they last. They sure took a long time to get here, like I said. And I can't find them anywhere else. Oh yeah, I'm liking it already. Yeah, it's perfect. It matches my um perfectly with my um emblems on my rims. I put up on the rims. Oh yeah. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. See that? Yeah boy. <laughs> All right, so last package, um, I realized that I got the uh, wrong lights for the end dash for my car. I actually need the ones I got to weld in, so I might have to hold off on that for a little while. This is like a damn processor. These are headlights right here, though. All right, so this right here is a um, keychain for my keys. Keychain for the new set of keys. And this got a lot of good reviews on Amazon. Didn't come with a damn screwdriver. But, yeah, here's all you get. Sorry for the rough hands, I'm out there working, so your boy got rough hands. But yeah, I like, I like the quality of this. You know, nice little braided leather, BMW logo up on there. This twist all the way around. So, and I'm gonna put it on this part too. So you have a hanger from both of them so you can attach the key to stuff and then hold it like that. And then use these to hang some miscellaneous stuff. These are the interior lights, some more interior lights, blue. But this is for the uh, like back seats and stuff like that. So. These are the ones I never got around to getting from my uh, other BMW. The back seat lights replaced. And then for this damn processor, Core i5, it's like, but anyways, here it is. I can't wait, hopefully this turns out right. I know sometimes these LED lights don't work right with some cars and it kind of causes it to kind of flicker. Here it is right here. Can't wait to do my brakes, but First thing first is getting this bad boy running pristine. Once I get it running good, that's when I'm gonna be real happy, y'all. Like, I'm gonna be like, I'm about to excuse the expressions on some of the videos, because I'm gonna be real happy once I get this bad boy running. But I've been doing two birds at once. Uh, you see, I'm all in with it. So whatever fixes I need to be fixed, I mean, I'm already all in. I'm already buying all kind of stuff for it. So, catch you guys in the next video. Just wanted to show you guys a little bit of swagger. And uh, if you guys want to stay tuned to what I got going on with the vehicle itself, as far as the fixes and the cosmetic upgrades and stuff like that, stay tuned. I got a um, 
or subscribe, should I say. I got a YouTube series I got, you know, that I've been doing the start of this year, which I wasn't even planning on doing. And it's just me going through fixing on my car and it's like just other DIY stuff I'm gonna be doing like my son's um, Nintendo Switch. I'm about to um, do that inside all carbon fiber. He gave me the idea with that. So I told him I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So that's another DIY vlog I'm gonna do. And with those, it's pretty much me doing, instead of me doing voiceovers, which is, you know, real cool and professional and people love them, but it's cool to also do vlogs too, just like extended, you know, sit downs showing exactly how I'm doing certain things just side by side and talking to you guys while I'm doing it so that's the whole purpose of that you know so it could be kind of like interactive so with that being said people of YouTube it's been your boy the Universal Gamer damn so with that being said people of YouTube it's been your boy the Hobby Collector and catch you guys in the next video I'm out